thanks to a redesigned experience for how users expose, share, and request access to projects and their objects, reusing assets in Dataiku has never been easier. In each project's security menu, notice that some project contributors or groups have permissions to manage shared objects. This grants them the ability in the Shared Objects tab to add specific datasets, managed folders, saved models, and other objects to an approved list for reuse elsewhere. Going back to the flow, notice the arrow which appeared on this dataset, indicating its shared status. Owners can also share items directly from the flow, either selecting a target project to expose it to, or just enabling quick sharing for general discoverability purposes. The quick sharing setting authorizes users to freely reuse this object in other projects without requiring an explicit request. However, if project owners want more fine-grained control over shared objects, they can leave quick sharing off and activate use request workflows. Let's log on as a different user, Lucy, to understand how this works. Lucy is working on a related project. To save time, she would like to reuse these reference datasets in her other project. Since the locations and competitor locations dataset were authorized for quick sharing, Lucy can immediately expose them to her target project. However, the customer's dataset will require a sharing request. She enters a message and submits it. Going back to our reference project where we are logged in as a user with Manage Shared Objects permissions, we can see an Access Request notification pop up. Visit the Notification Center to view and manage all requests. With Access granted, Lucy now has all three datasets shared into her target project. Furthermore, Projects themselves can be set to either private, which is the default, or limited access. This option determines what, if anything, users without any specific permissions on this project see about the project when they visit their homepage or the catalog. Access request workflows for projects can also be enabled, which can also include email alerts when a request is made. Now that we've turned on limited access and access requests for just this one reference project, let's look at what another new team member, Michael, sees, who has no permissions on this project at all. Notice that Michael has no projects of his own yet, but if he uses global search or goes to the catalog, he can see the limited details about our reference project and request access if needed. With new visibility and managed sharing options, your team can strike the right balance between discoverability and control and collaborate in new ways.